So in this quick tutorial, we're just going to be uh, discussing navigation link and navigation views. And this is essentially the, uh, the equivalent of the segways and the storyboards they used to have previously in the UI kit and storyboard method of, um, of UI design. So now we have Swift UI. So we'll get started by creating a new project. So we're creating a new project. It'll be a single view application. We'll name this navigation, navigation uh, link tutorial. And I'm going to use Swift and Swift UI as the language user interface, and I just keep all these checked all the time. All right, I'll put it on the desktop. I'll create it. And what we need to do is we need to create uh, the view that we're going to be starting from and the view that we're going to be ending at. So we're always going to start by default on content view. And then we're going to need to create a new file, so command N or file, new file. And I'm going to create a new Swift UI view file, and I'm going to name it destination view. And so now I have a new uh, view called destination view. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to have content view now will become, we're going to make it a navigation view. That's what will allow us to use the navigation features. So this text hello world now, it's going to say, we're going to make it say home view. And I'm going to go to destination view and I'm going to make that a navigation view as well. And the text there is going to say destination view. That's how we know we're on one versus the other. So this one now says destination view once it updates. And this one says home view. And what we'll do is we'll create a navigation link. And this navigation link is going to have a destination. And that destination is going to be the destination view. So what we're telling it is as follows. I'm going to put this in the center. So what we're saying is whenever I click on anything, so whenever I click on home view, I want you to take me to the destination view. So if we, if we look right here and I click play so I can preview this, watch what happens once this updates and we click on the home view, it will automatically use this text as a button that navigates us. Click home view and here we are in destination view and I can just go back. So all I had to do is create a navigation link inside my navigation view and that had to we say the destination is a destination view which I can find right over here. Alright and it's easy as that. See you in the next video.